Okay. Hey everyone. Um, this is going to be a quick video on um, just sh me showing you guys how to make your own bath salt. Um, what you'll need is some salt. You can use kosher salt, sea salt, or regular salt. Um, I'm just going to use regular edelweiss salt, like table salt I guess you can call it. So I'm going to use some of this. And you need a Ziploc baggie and you can just put some in there. Um, you can also mix it in a bowl. But all I want to do is I'm going to mix it in here because it will make, make it easier to mix it in here. The next thing you'll need is some any kind of like scented oil that they sell at like I think Michaels and other stuff that you use that's just like scented oil. Or um, you can use any kind of like cologne or anything like that, your favorite scent. But what I'm going to use is the cucumber melon scent, cucumber melon uh, body spray. I'm going to use some of this and just put it in there and then you, you need food coloring. So um, you can use any color that you like. What you want to do is you want to take out any color. Um, I guess I'll go ahead and do um, green. You can also mix the colors if you like. Um, it's totally up to you. Um, I'll probably probably do that just to see how it goes. But what you want to do is you want to take your food coloring and you want to put like um, three or four drops in there. And you want them so it'll look kind of, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it'll look kind of like that. Um, then what you want to do is you want to take, so instead of spray, I'm going to take a few sprays. And I'm just going to spray a little bit in there. Just going to spray. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pour a little bit in there. And you can, um, what you want to do is you want to take, you know what, I'm going to add a little bit more food color to this. What you want to do is you just want to take your zip off bag and you want to make sure that y it's sealed all the way and that there's no air in it. You don't want any air in there when you do this. So what you want to do is you just want to take your salt and you just want to kind of get it like a moisture and just kind of mix it all in until you get the color that you want. Um, and the good thing about this is that you can never, you can't go wrong because if you if the color is too dark for you, what you can do is you can add more salt, or you can, if the color is too light, you can add more food color. But this color seems to be okay for me, so you just want to keep doing that until you get like all the color in there. You get like all the salt color. Like I said, you can add more like a different color to it. You can add all kinds of colors at the same time or if you don't really like this particular color what you can do is and I really like this color but what I'm going to do is I'm going to add um, I'm going to add a little bit of blue just want to add that to there so like I said just kind of make sure your bag zipped and you have no air in it and just kind of mix it in and it might not get any darker or it might just stay the same color or whatever um, but this seems to be getting a little bit darker so I'm going to add a little bit more blue because I didn't add too much then like I said um, like I said you can use any kind of salt it doesn't really matter but just kind of make sure that um, when you're doing this, that make sure that the baggie is zipped because you don't want it, the salt to get everywhere. So it's going to look something like this. This is the blue and the green mix. So you can, it's like a turquoise color, which is a really, actually a really pretty color. Um, so this is what you can do. You can use this. This is how you can make your own bath salt. You can use it for like making, for like give it to somebody. You can put it like in jars and use it for like Christmas gifts. 
or birthday gifts or something and if you can put it like in a jar and put a bow on it and you can um, just give it to them and I'm actually going to see how this goes. You can, like I said, you can use cologne or anything like that. And it actually does smell like cucumber melon. So it actually smells really good. Um, so yeah, this is how you guys can make your own bath salt. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys want to see more, um, just let me know in the comment box and or if you want to see other colors, you know, let me know and I'll be glad to do that for you guys. Just comment down below. Bye guys!